Friday, events day. One brother, Ari, Two. Luke, three brothers. We're back. We haven't been training with Harry for the last little while because we've been a little bit busy. Be good to catch up, see how he's getting on. Mm -hmm. Big Tommy. Hey Harry, nice to see you for a long time. How are you getting on, bro? I'm good, man. Good. Yeah. Hey, so we're back. <laughs> Jeez, four weeks has been a long time. Hey. So, first up is Log Press. FYI, this is my last event session before Europe's. It's not yours. Why are you not coming to Europe? <laughs> Didn't get invited down, huh? There. Hi. The usual stuff, uh, log, five frees, and then up to the warehouse to do some frame, some stones, and sandbag with Leo. Harry can join in with her, please, as well, because that's well, a bit of fun. I've got time. I've got Oakley today, so yeah. time restrictions. Tomorrow we're all going bowling as well. The Stolten family are going bowling. Who's going to win bowling? Not you. You Not would be suppressed what I can do with bowling. Suppressed. Though. You'd be they call me the Atlas Stone King, so now I'm the Rollerball King. Tom's going to take an Atlas Stone to the bowling tomorrow. Tom still uses the ramp, doesn't he? Ah! Hey. And the bump and the barriers. <laughs> the, anyway, let's go trade. So, this is the last log press before Europe's Strongest Man, where we have Max Log. So today, going to be working up to uh, around 200 kilos. Uh, the plan is for a double at 200. Was it, that's what I did before Arnold's? Something like that, anyway. So, yeah, 200 for a double. Save some energy, 200 for a double is decent. And then go down to Europe's and hit something a little bit tasty. I believe the jumps are... I think it's starting like 170. I can't remember if it's 185, 200, and then we've got a in between, I think there's 210, then 218, and then 230 uh, down at Europe. So it'll be interesting, some great log pressers there. We've got Iron Bubby coming across, Bobby Thompson, and a few of the European guys looking really good in the log as well. So. Are you going for the record or is this just a tester? I'll see how spicy I feel on the day. If I feel the same way as I did at Arnold's, um, I'll definitely go heavy because I felt like I could have pressed quite a lot at Arnold's. So if I bring that same intensity, um, yeah, I'll go for something big, sexy, and very spicy.
Why did you do so much rap stuff? <laughs> I'm just the guy that does all the weights. That's Dan, he's the coach. Dan, why am I doing so much reps? Three sets of eight. I think I'm just restarting. I'm trying to, I don't know, maybe build um, some sh shoulder endurance. Obviously, when you do a bit more work, reps, when you go into the singles and doubles, you know, I might not be as kind of fatigued. I don't know. I'm not too sure, but yeah, I feel b a bit better on the log, my position and stuff, and the reps, but it is only 110, so hopefully, when we get onto the wooden log in a few weeks, this pays off. So, But you'll have to ask Danny about that. I just lift weights and he, he tells me what to do. What do you find harder, the metal or the wooden log? The wooden log, probably for pressing it. Cleaning's easier on it, but it's because the metal log's so wee, it's a bit easier to to press. But they both have their advantages and both have their disadvantages. Some people prefer the metal, but I get so used to the wooden one that I'm, you know, I got better with it. But now, obviously, I'm not going to be using the wooden log for another few weeks yet, so I'll probably end up getting better at the metal one and then take me a bit to get back to the wooden. But metal shielding. I don't want eight reps to go.
Jesus Christ. Do it again. Do How was that like? Uh, harder than it should have been, but uh, still two reps is near enough, but, but more of a struggle than I would have liked it to be. <coughs> it felt easier than it did before Arnold's, which is a good sign. Yeah, I know on the day I'll be okay. It's just a little bit annoying sometimes when you expect it to be. Um, you can expect it to be a lot better than that, but it's one of those things. So we are now going on to power stairs. Which I'm ecstatic about. Yeah, log press was uh, felt really good actually. Did a, a deload last week, like a full deload. Um, didn't do events or anything, just a couple kind of recovery things, and oh, it just made, made a huge difference, you know. Um, added a couple extra reps in the last set. It wasn't like tremendously heavy, um, just more kind of rep work, a bit of cardio as well. So I'm just excited to uh, up the weight next week, see where it goes. So, the next event is power stairs. Uh, Harry came up with the genius idea of using the mirror fit bench, which is like 0.2 under the height it's meant to be, it's meant to be 18 inches off the ground, so from last week to this week it's not going to be as wobbly. We're able to jump up onto the bench as well to get used to, you know, taking the weight up and down. So, we've got five sets of three at 160 today. Obviously proper power stairs, you'll see at Europe you go up, 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 run down, up, 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 but this is the best we can do this now until we get one. So yeah, we're gonna start and see how it goes. It's basically a duck walk loaded onto 18 inch steps three times, uh, five implements. We've got a, a little kind of duck walk attachment from Mirafit and we're loading up onto the Mirafit bench which is about 18 inches. It's an 18 inch pickup as well, we've been told. The weights at Europe's are 200 to 250, which is nice and heavy. So we're going a little bit lighter today. It's only 165, so we're just needing to get into that rhythm of doing it. And we're still waiting to find out, but we've kind of roughly been told that some of the events will be at World, so hopefully we'll go into plan. We'll find out soon, and uh, we can incorporate that into our training. So yeah, we'll just keep plodding away. Um, like with, with the duck walk, it's very, need to be really, really explosive off the ground and make sure that when you're, I'll demonstrate, so when you're picking it up, you need to make sure it stays on the platform. <coughs> Hands off. So that's, if it falls over, then you have to make sure it sits upright, so. <coughs> it's a bit of a, bit of a bastard for getting you bruises in the inner legs, so. It'll be fun, it'll be quite an explosive event. And that's it, that's the power stairs. Well done Giants Live. New event at Giants Live, Europe's Strongest Man. I think it's great to see the kind of more newer events coming in. So it'll be fun, so stay tuned for that.
<laughs> I'm fighting the kilos of weight. Felt good, bro. Why are we not jumping on the bench? Happen safety, baby. <laughs> What are we doing now? We are now going on to Hercules Hold. With the width of the, the Hercules Hold arms, the handles, you can't hold it, get them both up yourself, so Harry and I will kind of lift the arms up to him and then Tom will take the grip, we'll have the weight and we'll just lower it down and then Tom will say when he's got it and then that's it, kind of timer will start then. So. What sort of times are you aiming for? Um, we did about a minute last week so that's pretty decent, just kind of go for that so that'll be fine, yeah, a minute and then take it from there I guess. Yep. I just lower it nice and slow it down. Got the grip properly, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Right. You count yeah, Three, two, one, yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice, Tom. Every ten seconds. Ten. Twenty. Thirty. Forty. Come on, one minute. Oh, good job. Oh. Keep going. Shank you, bruv. Bang. How was it, Tom, bro? Yeah, good. I mean, I think last year we got up to 325s in our last week or so at uh, Hercules, and second weekend I hit a minute three PB. So, happy days. Put Vipers on and just zone out. Three, two, one, go. Ten. Twenty. Thirty. Forty. Fifty. Now we squeeze. Come on. Go. Go. Keep going. Come on. Hold. 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 Hold it. Sixty. Good. Come on. Keep going. Come on. What's the hardest thing about Hercules? It's just like, switching off, it's just, you know it's going to be sore. Yeah, it's just one of those ones that's kind of painful from the get-go. You've just got to be able to switch off and just focus and just, you know, it hurts but it's not forever. There's obviously a crowd and when they go wild, does that, does that help you? Oh that yeah, when the good? crowd are behind you, it really like encourages you to do a little bit more, kind of hold on. Because that's all we're doing is holding on, holding on to handles you know when you put it into kind of layman's terms it's not really that complex what we're doing it's just squeezing it holding it see this apparatus that we've got is fine it's not the best um, it should be drilled into the the ground that's why there's like a bend and it moves about a little bit but it's fine it's um we make do and we just keep going so no it's it's good fun it's a little it just gets you in your forearms as well it's like a pump 
and your forearms. That was, was Harry's first ever time doing Hurtley's, he's just going to join in. And he's doing the big boy weights. We're going to rip his arms off. Don't even know why. <laughs> okay. Tell oh, me. Yeah, come on. Squeeze it, just squeeze it. Good. Good, yeah, Harry. Keep squeezing. Ten. When it gets harder, you squeeze. Come on. Twenty. Squeeze. Let's get thirty at least. Come on. <gasps> squeeze. Come on, squeeze. Thirty. Good, Harry. Really good. That's it. Take it. <laughs> Sorry. Come on. Come on. Nice, Harry. Come on. 50. Yes, Harry. Come on. Beat us. Come on. Easy. One minute. Easy. Keep going. Oh. One turn. <laughs> Arms feel like well long now. <laughs> oh. You just beat Tommy. Easy. <laughs> all, in, all, in a day, all in a day's work. Excuse me. Excuse me. How does it feel, Tommy? It is what it is, isn't it? You want you want competition, bruv. I'm the top boy around this joint, yeah. Hold that. Yeah, keep going down. Keep going down. Three, two, one, get mine. Get top. Ten. I'm holding top. Twenty. Good. Thirty. Breathe, Tom. Oh, nice. That's it. Forty. Nice. Fifty. Come on, keep going. Again, squeeze. Come on, again. Come on. So got more. One minute. More time. Come on. Squeeze. Come on. Come on. One ten. Yeah. <laughs> one, one twelve, Tommy. I hope that's not a world that hurts. Huh? Let's see your hand. It's the pit vipers, bro. Three, two, one. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Have a time to Come on. Keep it going. Come on. Oh, minute seven. Oh, that's good. Yep. Ten. Good, huh? Twenty. 
Sorry. Sorry. Go on. Sorry. Keep it going. Good, sorry. Come on. Come on, squeeze that in. Come on. Come on, Harry. Come on. Keep it going, Harry. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Mate, come on. It's the Hercules hold done. My first time doing it felt really good. That grip work has really paid off. Uh, takes a wee bit of getting used to. It's a, a horrible exercise. A bit awkward to set up with this this setup, but yeah, it's up to the warehouse now to finish off. Let's do this. What have we got in the warehouse? I've got a uh, sandbag, over the yoke, uh, stones. Where are we, Tom? We are at. Some facility in the Highlands of Scotland. A new warehouse. Would you like to see inside? Okay, look, open. <laughs> and the trick with this, only the real strongest men in the world can open those doors. It was forged in the 19th hundred century, century by dwarfs and elves. This is made of elf, elfish gold. Welcome to the land of elves. William Mulligan, this is for you. It was a Lord of the Rings reference. I am Legolas. I will be tonight. Hey! hey. What's the first event, Tommy Bro? We're doing sandbag carry into yoke. Nice and easy. Yoke there. Have a little break. Yoke to the front and yoke back. Yeah, then take the yoke back and then sandbag. Yeah. So we'll do that and then maybe drop the weight of the yoke yeah. a little bit for you. Yeah. So I'm going to set up two, two of the yokes. Yeah. No, just be as quick because I'll do like 200. What we're going to do here, um, so we're doing sandbag, so 15 meter sandbag run. Sorry, I just farted. 15 meter sandbag run into yoke, then 15 meter yoke run, have a little break, then run back with the yoke, run back with the sandbag, then I'll go in. So that's Tom that does it first because it's set to Tom's height. Then I'll go in, I'll do it, and then we'll swap, swap it for Harry as well. So we did it last, last week and it worked really well. So it's nice because we've got the length now in the other warehouse. We could only maybe do 15 meter runs, but now we can do 15 meter run into another 15 meter run and really kind of get that kind of that length that we need. Because before that's what was, I think that was what was kind of screwing up some of my yoke runs. Have you noticed when I was running with the yoke, a lot of the times I dropped after 10 meters about halfway, and that's what we could only do last time. So um, with this, hopefully it'll teach me not to drop the yoke after 10 meters. What are you measuring, bro? <laughs> He's asking me questions when I'm trying to remember numbers. <laughs> How long is that, bro? Uh, that was 15 inches. <laughs> yeah. Three, two, one, go. Do this into a joy. How are your hands after Hercules? They hurt. They, it just it feels like shaky. You can see it kind of. You can see it. They're shaking a little bit. Only joy, and they're fine. Oh no, I squeeze something and it hurts. Ah, 
I'm so hard done by, I squeezed hands and it really sore. Now I can't compete. Shut up, Luke, you idiot. Of course I'm fine. Jeez. Three, two, one, go. <coughs> It's just one of those things with Tom. I don't think he lowered it. Daddy Luke will come in. Yeah, see, come help. Yeah, see. There you go. Will you just do me a wee three, two, one as well? Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Come on, come on. Good. You see donuts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it went uh, very good. Um, sandbag into yolk. It's a light sandbag and the yolk's still quite light, so I'm feeling comfy and the warehouse is great. We don't have any obstacles in our way and you can just kind of go full tilt built into it. So next up, just put it here at the stones. What's the benefits of having this warehouse, I think? It's cool. <laughs> it's high. It's got walls and stuff. It's got loads of concrete. <laughs> you can see there's concrete in that corner. Oh, I felt well out headed on that sandbag. Guys, as you can see, we have got a new set of at the stones from Atlas Endurance in Edinburgh. Very nice stones with a nice uh, touch of the sunflowers uh, to represent mum, and obviously, sunflowers are a big part of our life. So, yeah, it's really, really nice. Um, we're going to try not to wreck them, we're trying to look after them as much as we can. But we've got a set from 100 all the way up to 210 kilograms, which will be is usually the last stone in World's Strongest Man. So, yeah, we've got one, two, three, four, five seven stones so a, a you know good variety of stones and uh, yeah like i said we're gonna try and look after them so big fight you tap this endurance for your stone needs you know they do a lot of kind of personalized stones they do cool colored stones they do basic stones go check them out they're from edinburgh at this endurance on instagram and uh, get your stones today now we're gonna go lift some stones stay spicy Okay. <laughs> That's that Jones, remember him? Oh yeah. How's the strongman journey going? It's going good. Training's going well. Mm. Getting stronger. That's all I can ask for. Yeah, trying some new stuff, uh, like the yoke and the uh, Hercules. It was uh, just a bit of fun added to the training. What do you need something? Shaved. <laughs> Boys and girls. Harry's got a hairy chest. <laughs> I never shaved. You know, put hairs on your chest. Um, I'm just going to go up to 210. Have some fun. Are you going to one motion it today? That's telling. Look at that magic trick though. Mm -hmm. 
How's the new stones, bro? Lovely. I know because you're overlapping maybe a little bit to try and hold the stone. Because if you know, imagine if you've only got one hand on the stone, it's not as uh, yeah. So smooth, doesn't it? It's on your lap. Your thing, you'll feel it like missing last week and going back onto the yeah. stones. It's like so when you get it, takes you a wee while for your mind. You can take in the piss, man. Who inspired you to dance like that? Uh, Michael Jackson. Uh. I mean, Tom, obviously, last Sorry. week. <laughs> I guess we should, I did like an OK 181 motion and then Tom does 210 like it's a pebble. Yeah, one and done. Just break the same way as you did the 160. Nice and aggressive. Come on, Hart. Come on. Yes, yes, oh, yes. Squeeze. Come on. Big pop now, Hart. Yes, Come on. Oh. Oh. Wow. Ah, almost. Jeez. Wow. Close. <laughs> <laughs> Long straight, nice and switched off. Oh, fuck. Too fast. What have you done? Drop my mouth, guys. <laughs> <laughs> There's tacky on it as well. Put it in my mouth. Other way. Other way. I like ups and yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> focus. Come on. Come on, Tom. Come on. <laughs> Good, lucky Ali doesn't have any mess. I'm not better, yeah. Ready? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Here we have Simon Celestial on the 200, 100. Come on, Simon. Please. Let's go, Simon. Come on. Yeah. Yes, Let's see the dance. Let's see the dance. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> How does that feel, Simon? Not too bad, actually. It's quite easy. Did you fart? <laughs> I farted. Yeah. Tom. What did you rate, uh, rate Simon Stone left there? 10 out of 10. You know, usually when you fight, you follow through on stones like I did, and he didn't, so I'm happy. And is that a fact? Yeah. So Tommy fact is? 10 out of 10, and when you fart on stones, you usually follow through, and he didn't. There we go. But well, when he checks his pants, you know. <laughs> Harry? That's uh, Tom, Tom's knowledge, wealth of knowledge. Uh, he's shart, sharted a lot. 
And yeah, it's not nice. Like, what do you reckon to Simon's attempt? 10 out of 10, mate. Ten out that was 10. there. We're proud of you, Simon. What's up, what's up? Why am I yep. taking I thought we were going to fall. Jesus, <laughs> quite cuddle me. Too weird. What you <laughs> Event session done. That's been a long month without Harry as well, so it's nice to have Harry back on his road to be and road to becoming a straw man. He joined in some Hercules and then some of World Strawman Man events. We did and nearly hit a 180 stone, which was uh, very cool to see after having a few weeks off uh, straw man stuff with his deload and stuff. So yeah, we're back in the new warehouse. The warehouse is massive. It's cool. There's no distractions now. Nothing in the way. And we can be like big kids when they come up here, so it's cool. Rain or shine, we've got space now to train. So, how was the training, Har Harvey? Yeah, really good. I'm uh, delighted where, where I'm at just now. That deload week really, really helped me. So, just ready to put on more weight now. Get chunky! So, that is the last session for me, or event session before Europe's Strongest Man. We're going to go down, or I'm going to go down, sorry, on Friday with Simon. Gabriel, Harry's coming down as well, um, so it'll be awesome. Tom's got some other commitments. I'll be working hard on a Friday for with. Uh, I might take wee Shawnee up here, Clark, and do a wee training session with him. But I'll always be watching. So, you know, I'm not going to be there, but I'm going to be tuning in like I did last year. You know, so it's going to be a good big shout. Luck, good luck to this old bandit here, and uh, yeah, hopefully he wins it and takes it back to Scotland again, and then we can prep properly for the big one. W. Mm, means World's strongest man There we go Wasn't Wasn't <laughs> Right, anyway, thank you for watching Keep liking this And uh, all our spicy t-shirts are back in stock now So go to the website Hit the basket and buy it Buy all this stuff Buy every merchandise that we've got Just buy everything uh, We love you guys Thank you for the support And uh, no, we will not be stepping in the ring soon Stay safe, smile and stay spicy yeah. And please don't forget to ring that little bell <laughs> Ding, 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 ding. ding.